Welcome back. Another ep update of the uh, coronavirus situation. It is uh, 5.58 p.m. March 30th, 2020. The first thing I wanted to bring to everybody's attention is uh, coronavirus in Florida. That's projected to hit 6,766 people by August. Most important thing about this article and these projections are who it was done by. The analysis was done by the Institute for Health Metrics and Evaluation at the University of Washington under the direction of Professor Chris Murray. I looked up Chris Murray and he is definitely qualified to be an expert in this field. It's his job to predict these numbers, which is unfortunate that he's predicting this number. He's also predicting that Florida will face a peak shortage of 843 intensive care unit hospital beds. And he's also predicting 82,141 COVID-19 deaths throughout the nation. Trump also came on TV today and said that if we can keep this thing to 100,000 deaths, it will be a good number. So these are scary, scary numbers. Um, and something we all need to be paying attention to. This is the second thing I wanted to bring to your attention. An article that just came out not too long, about 20 minutes ago. It said a Florida pastor was arrested after holding church services despite coronavirus orders. Car after car pulled into the river at Tampa Bay Church parking lot tonight. Church leaders kept their doors open for worship after Hillsborough County deputies contacted them regarding the large crowd at the Sunday morning service. Pastor Rodney Howard Brown defended that decision in a Facebook Live post titled, End of Days, Part 3. So I'm not, again, negating that people are dying from the coronavirus. We're not, we're not saying that. We're just saying that the faith is blown totally way out of proportion. And if you shut the church down, the church is not a non-essential service. Right? In a statement to the press from March 18th, the church posted it will do everything in our power to support the efforts of our wider community by cleaning and sanitizing surfaces and take any other recommended measures to protect our people and keep them healthy and safe. Here at the road leading to the church, deputies have put up this sign that says, practice social distancing, stay six feet apart, maximum 10 people. Tonight, the sheriff's office says it has advised church leaders of the danger they are putting themselves and their congregation in by not maintaining appropriate social distancing at a time when COVID-19 cases are unfortunately still on the rise in Hillsborough County. Again, for people who think that this is a joke and that they are and are not following the rules, just know that there's 63 confirmed deaths right now on March 30th, 2020, and the projections are 6,600. Subscribe, hit the bell, and um, I'll see you guys very soon.